a tease of Iraq and Rana Sag people. To curtail the impact on the West from a decentralized IS, the officials said Iraq has stepped up existing coordination and exchange of information with authorities in Western Europe, the United States and Australia. Already, the militants are laying the groundwork for a strategy of hiding in remote areas, carrying out attacks in Iraq and abroad and resorting to organized crime to bankroll operations, intelligence and counterterrorism officials said. The Iraqi army and popular forces must defeat it in Mosul, otherwise, they will be obliged to move to eastern Syria in order to fight the terrorist group, he said. But the Kurdish official was less sanguine, saying the battle for Mosul was now more difficult and could descend into a long-drawn-out siege similar to those seen in Syria. Nevertheless, Securing territory west of Mosul by the Iranian-backed militias has other benefits for Iran's allies, by giving the Shiite fighters a launch pad into neighboring Syria to support Assad. Zarif makes no mention of Iranian support for the embattled and brutal Assad regime or interference in Iraq over the last decade. Iran knows this, and that is why it is not only destroying bastions of Sunni Arab civilizations such as Mosul and Aleppo but also the very idea and identity of what it means to be a Sunni Arab. And with only makeshift, quasi-functional hospitals, the citizens and rebel forces in eastern Aleppo appear unable to weather the excruciating war of attrition and ceaseless bombardment much longer. Thanks for viewing this tease. Sign up for the Tip Top Tech channel or search for a Tease Second Mind on YouTube to find and then enjoy other teas.